Hey everyone, it's Hassan here, and I just kind of want to put together a video of the Wii U. Kind of just showing off the menu and uh, the Wada Wada Plaza and Miiverse, because I think those are some of, uh, you know, obviously the menu and the OS and everything is kind of important. And Miiverse is uh, a pretty big deal for Wii U as well. So I just kind of wanted to put together a little something. Um, I'm going to do this entirely on the gamepad just because it's easier and you can see everything on the gamepad anyways. Um, so here's the Wii U gamepad. Um, and uh, so yeah, this is it right here. Um, this is what I have on my screen so far. As you can see, I kind of moved over those icons there. Um, basically, I've gone all digital. So I traded in Nintendo Land actually because I got the deluxe set and got the download version, and I got New Super Mario Bros. U and Assassin's Creed 3, so three retail games on here, and Nano Assault Neo I downloaded recently. It's also a demo of FIFA Soccer 13. We have the Wii menu right there, which basically boots your Wii U into a Wii. Um, Netflix, YouTube, Hulu Plus, Amazon Video, um, got your system settings, Wii U Chat, Daily Log, the Uplay app, the Mii Maker, um, that icon to use for obviously playing disc-based games, parental controls, health and safety, blah blah blah. Um, down at the bottom here you have uh, Miiverse, the eShop, the internet browser, uh, Nintendo TV which is not active as of now, and notifications. Um, so this is what you're seeing on the gamepad on the TV right now, if I had it up, you would see the Wada Wada Plaza. But you can actually switch um, to that on the gamepad by either pressing that there, you can press X, so we'll switch that over, and here is the Wada Wada Plaza, and you can kind of zoom in and out if you want to, um, and uh, you can kind of see the messages from different people sort of popping up, so you can sort of zoom in. These are some of uh, my me's and my friend's me's right there, and people that I've followed on Miiverse. Where's my me? I don't see my me anywhere. Hmm, I wonder where I am probably off looking at something but anyways so you can, as you kind of scroll around here you can sort of see different messages from people pop up like somebody's asking if they should purchase the game there um, lots of people playing uh, that uh, <laughs> it's pretty cool actually to see a lot of the you know I've kind of just explored around seeing different drawings and stuff pop up on the Wada Wada Plaza. So what's going on right now is basically Miiverse is uh, something built into the Wii U and it's basically a social network where you can uh, post to gaming related communities. So you have a community for New Super Mario Bros. U, for Assassin's Creed 3, Zombie U, Nintendo Land, all the different Wii U games and the different apps like Netflix and YouTube and Uplay and all that stuff. Um, and you post to those either in text or with drawings. Um, and you can view those, and whether you have the game or not, like you don't even have to have the game to post in that community, basically. And uh, on the Wada Wada Plaza, you have whatever icons are here, and it's you can't pick the icons that are here; it's just random. Although you can press the the L and R buttons and kind of switch the icons around if you want; it'll kind of make the me scatter around. Um, but basically, oh hey, there's my comment right there. Let's click on it. There I am. Um, but, uh, yeah, so basically, um, then what you can do is in certain games where it's built in, uh, well, every game has a community on Miiverse, but certain games it's built in, which right now it's only, like, Nintendo Land, New Super Mario Bros. U, that kind of thing, um, for those games, basically, it's, uh, what am I trying to say? It's sort of integrated. So, for example, in the Nintendo Land Plaza, you have the people in the plaza their messages from Miiverse will pop up and that kind of thing. But, uh, so right here in the Wada Wada Plaza, which is kind of built into the OS, you can kind of look around and see different messages from people. So, for example, if I click on my me or someone else's me, you can see their message. This is from Nintendo Land. So I can go straight to that post. I can view that person's profile. And this is all through Miiverse. So if I click on one of those, it'll open up Miiverse. You know, so, like, let's scroll around here. Let's see. Um... Let's see what somebody's saying that's interesting. Uh, tch, tch, tch. Hmm. Let's click on Roth. This guy, Roth, 
he has some awesome uh, drawings and stuff. So you can see he posted this really cool drawing of Darksiders 2. So you can view this post on Miiverse. So let's click on that. And it will open up Miiverse. The, the only unfortunate thing with Wii U right now is that there's some decent loading times, as you'll see, to open up some of these things like Miiverse. Once you're actually in it, it's not too bad, but loading it up, it can kind of um, be annoying. Let me get the stylus out and be a little easier. So here's that post on Miiverse, and you can see his comment there. And uh, you can basically yeah the post, which is sort of like you like it or retweet it. Um, so I already yeah it, which is why it's now it's saying you can un yeah it. Um, so a lot of people have, have done this one. And you can sort of reply to it as well, as you can see. Um, so that's from taking you directly there. But anyways, I'll click on kind of, you know, if I click on user menu, you have these icons here. And you can search for users and send them friend requests this way. Um, you can, I'll go to my profile here. You can kind of set a little description if you want, see the number of yeahs you've gotten, all the different posts that you have made you can kind of keep track of. Yeah, I suck at drawing, so that's all I can do. Um, but so you can kind of see that. You can also, if, when you're in a game, certain games like Nano Assault Neo, for example, if you open up Miiverse while you're in a game, which you just press the home button and select on Miiverse to do that, some games will give you the option to attach a screenshot. So for Nano Assault Neo, I just put a screenshot of the title screen there, but... Um, that's kind of nice. Uh, so you can click on friends and see your friends there. Um, you can follow people on Miiverse so you, because the friend list is kind of full. Because um, you can only have 100 friends, you can instead follow people on Miiverse. Um, so I've kind of followed a bunch of different people from NeoGAF and all, all over the place. Um, so that's pretty cool. And I have five followers. So they're my followers. Oh, hey, look at that. That's... Uh, Mickey from uh, NintendoFuse.com, which if you're not, if you haven't checked out NintendoFuse.com, check that out. He's the owner of the site, and I uh, write for it as well and do a Nintendo Fuse podcast. So, so I'm gonna send him a friend request. So once he gets that request, he can sort of, uh, you know, respond back. Which is interesting because if you go through the friends list and you send a friend request. The other person is not going to receive a request, they have to manually add it. But if you do it this way, like I did from the profile, click on friends or whatever, um, then they'll get a uh, friend request, which you view that, I want to say, is it under messages? No. Activity feed? Um, I can't remember. Oh, it's probably under notifications, actually which we'll take a look at. The activity feed kind of takes a little while to load because I have a bunch of people that I'm sort of following, so you can sort of see that there and view other um, posts as well. So that's pretty cool. Well, yeah, that post right there. Um, so here are the communities that I was talking about on Miiverse. So you have all the different communities for the games. Um, and uh, you can favorite certain communities. I don't know why. I think I accidentally favorited the Uplay one, so let's unfavorite that one. I don't want to favorite that. But uh, so you can kind of see what people have posted about that community and that kind of thing. So that's pretty neat. You can go to messages so you can send people direct messages as well. Um, so that's cool. Um, I originally apparently you can't put like links or URLs in your profile thing so the admins sent me a message saying you have to change that. Um, but you can kind of see your updates to see people here. So um, for example I posted in the Nintendo TV community, so I got a notification, uh, told the people in Japan, you know, hope you enjoy Wii U, blah, 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 and then uh, somebody was asking, you know, when is Nintendo TV coming to the U.S., so I said that. So it's pretty sweet, actually. It's like basically an online message board, and here are the friend request page if you had any, but I don't have any right now. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to close out of that, and it'll take me back to uh, the Wii U menu, um, uh, or right where I was here. Um, so it's pretty sweet. I like that. Um, I like that a lot, actually, that functionality. And um, what you can do, basically, is, like I said, within any game, you can access Miiverse. Um, and so, for example, let's kind of boot something up here. Um, let's just boot up Nintendo Land because I like the startup music. Um, mm -hmm. Mm-hmm.
Do, 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 do. It's very catchy. So there are some load times initially when you're booting things up, which is, um, you know, it's kind of annoying, but hopefully they'll, they'll fix those soon. It's definitely taking its time with this one. But once it loads up, and there we go, I can show you what happens when you press the home button. Alright, so there's the home. Um, actually, let me go to the plaza real quick. And you can kind of see on the plaza, if I kind of run down here, all the Miis here are connected to Miiverse as well. Um, so, for example, you'll kind of see messages pop up, but you can tap on them when Miiverse is active. Why is it not active right now? That's weird. Normally, stuff usually pops up. Maybe the connection's not good right now. I don't know. Um, anyways, press the home button. And it basically suspends the game, takes a couple seconds, but there you go. So you can see what friends are online and go to the friends list and view that. You can go straight to Miiverse, like I said. You can access the eShop, browser, any of these things as well. Um, so that is pretty cool. And that's basically it, you know. That's uh, the Wii U OS and the Wada Wada Plaza and Miiverse. So if anyone has any specific questions or things they would like to see, let me know. Um, I got a request uh, from somebody to show off a bit of Nano Assault Neo, so I'm going to post up a video of that next, kind of showing off what that's like briefly. So stay tuned for that, and if there's anything else on Wii U you want to know, let me know. And check out NintendoFuse.com for all the latest coverage on Wii U as well. See you guys later!